Hello people, welcome back to the channel, Dreaming Out Loud RVing. Do you want to save up to 30, maybe 40 cents per gallon of diesel fuel? Who doesn't, right? Let me show you an easy way to do that that won't cost you a dime. Stay tuned. <music> Megan and I have been RVing for many years. We have a lot of experience and we have a lot of experiences. One of those experiences is driving down the road to your destination, getting low on fuel, trying to find a place to pull in, stressing a little bit that it might be a little tight. I've done that. I'm sure most of us have. How would you like to have the feeling when you're driving down the interstate that you can pull into a truck stop whip into the truck lanes with plenty of room and fuel right there at the truck pump with no hassle. So what is it that's gonna relieve your stress driving down the road wondering if you can fit into a gas station? This right here, baby. EFS card, TSD Logistics card. This will allow you to fuel up at many of the truck stops and the truck lanes. So this is gonna make your RV travel days awesome. So TS, TSD Logistics, as a fleet card. This card will let you pull into the truck lane, pay at the mm. pump. With this card, you can travel with confidence up and down the interstates. This card will work at Pilot, Loves, Flying J, and a few others. As long as it's a truck lane, you can pull in there and use it. You don't have to be intimidated to use a truck lanes. The truckers don't mind. Just be respectful. When you pull in, fuel up, and then pull forward. When you pull in to get your fuel in the truck lane, the screen is going to prompt you to do everything. So you put this card in and it's going to ask you, you know, what type of vehicle you are. You choose tractor and then it'll ask you your control number. You put in your control number. It'll ask you if you want DEF. And if you have a newer diesel, you use DEF, diesel exhaust fluid, and you just pump it right there at the pump. One tip on that DEF is that stuff smells like cat piss. Do not get it on you. And it stinks when you're pumping it. So when you're pumping that DEF and it clicks off, don't try to put any more in or it's going to come right back out on you. Just stop when it clicks. So when you're done at the station, the screen's going to prompt you through all the steps. And it's going to tell you to pull forward. In the diesel lanes, you pull out of the pump and there's usually a line on the pavement there that you pull up to to allow the trucks behind you to come in so they can get their fuel and def if they need. And you have a few minutes that you can run into the store and do some business in there and come out before they're pulling out anyway. Um, so in this video, I'll clip in and show you actually pulling up to the pump and using the card. I did it for the first time without the camper in tow because I didn't want the stress of pulling the camper through and just in case, you know. So it was it was pretty simple and I'll show you that. So a lot of the truck stops will have a sign that says trucks and cars. This is a smaller one. Man, but it's busy. So I'll just wait. Just wait in line here for it to open up and uh, so I can do this. Take your card. Move card quickly. Don't have a reward, I skip that. We're a tractor, we're not a reefer or anything else. And do I want deaf? Yes, I want deaf this time. 
my control number. And there we go. So another thing at the pump, if you've never fueled at a truck stop, which this was the first time for me, the fuel nozzle is very large. And when you pull that trigger, that fuel's coming out. It's almost like a NASCAR fuel station. And that's because the truckers' tanks are so big, they don't have all day to sit there and wait for their trucks to fill up. So just keep that in mind. When you're pumping that fuel, it's coming out. The numbers are flying. It's coming out. So what I've got, I've got these disposable gloves. I got these from Harbor Freight, $6, 50 pair. I take a pair of these when I get the fuel. And because the, the gas, the fuel pumps at these truck stops are disgusting. They're filthy. So I use these disposable gloves when I'm pumping the fuel to keep my hands clean. I can take them off and throw them away when I'm done. I had these cloth gloves I thought I was going to use. But then I got thinking if they get saturated with fuel and the filth, I don't want those in my truck, stinking up my truck. And I don't have an outside toolbox. So I got these 50 pair for six bucks. Work great. Something else I wanted to add that I forgot. When you're pulling into these truck stops, pay attention to where truckers pull in because it's different than the cars. You want to follow the truck entrance. And when you're pulling out, that can be a little tricky sometimes. So just pay attention to the signs. When you go to the TSD site, the application is pretty simple. It's just your general information for your name, address, that type of thing. And then you submit that application. It will take them seven, ten days, maybe a little longer, and a representative from the company will call you. That's when they ask for your social security number, which they have to have, and they'll ask you for your checking account number, which they have to have, because this card is linked directly to your checking account. It's not like a debit card. It doesn't come out immediately. You'll go get fuel today. It can take up to two business days to show up in your account. Another friend of ours that got this card, they opened up a separate checking account just for this card for security reasons. That's a, not a bad idea. If there's a breach in the company, well, you risk the chance of only losing what's in that account. TSD Logistics has opened this up to RVers knowing that we will use the fuel on a regular basis. That way, the more people using the fuel, using their card, the more they can offer the discount. So the more, more using the card, the better. The discount, you can save 30, 40 cents per gallon on this card. The discount doesn't show at the pump. What you see at the pump is the price of the fuel. Once you finish pumping, it goes through the system and comes right back and your discount shows up in the app that you have on your phone. There is an app that comes with this that you can download to your phone. It will show you price per gallon, and how much you saved. And I will show a screenshot of my last purchase. At the stop we just made that you saw me get gas, I put in $95.02, I believe. When I looked at my app, it came up to $78.39 with a 16 $16.63 savings. Okay, so this truck card is only good in the truck lanes. You can't use it in the regular fuel lanes in the front of the stores or any other stores. Um, you can use it just in the truck lanes. TSD Logistics takes 10% of the savings. So whatever you saved, they're going to take 10% of. Not the total sale, just the savings. Once your savings is calculated, TSD takes a 10% off of that only. And it's, it's worth it because you still save a lot per gallon. And it's, it's easy. It's free. doesn't cost you anything to do. And it it's, gives me such confidence to know when I'm traveling down the interstate with a big rig that I don't have to stress about having room to pull in and, and get fuel you know, you think you're big until you're pulling amongst all these tractor trailers. Then you quickly feel small, but it's a lot of room in there. Oh, and the cool thing, they got these big long poles on their window washers. Easy to clean your window. Your wife can do that.
Yeah, she can do that. So when the representative calls you on the phone, they're going to ask you for your social security number, like I mentioned, and they're going to ask you for your account number to the checking account to link it to. And then they'll approve you there and they'll send the card to you, which will take about another six or seven days to receive. Once you receive the card, you get a letter with the card that explains um, your control number and it explains how to set up your PIN. You have a PIN number to use in the app. So when you download the app, your PIN number opens that up and you can navigate through that. And it, you can put in this app the where you are. So from one address to the next. So wherever you're traveling from and to, it will show you all the fuel stations and truck stops that you can use this card and it will show you the cost of the fuel. Really don't see any, any negative side of having this card. It's a win-win. There are a few other features within the app that are beneficial. So I can't take credit for just coming up with this card. It's not like I researched it and discovered it myself. I got this from another YouTube channel. This couple I've been following for quite a while. They're retired and they're in a Class A motorhome. And the name of their channel is Our Journey in Miles. Miles is the name of their coach. They're a fantastic couple to watch. A lot of fun. So definitely check them out. And if you do go to the website and apply for the card, there's an area in there that you can put who referred you. Don't, don't put us. We don't need the credit. You do get credit for it. But our journey in miles, they turned us on to it. And I think it's only fair to pass it on to them. This card will allow you to travel with confidence. I hope this video has been helpful. I hope you got something out of it. And uh, remember, if you go to the website and apply for the card, put down our journey in miles. They don't watch our channel. They don't know who we are. But um, I think it's only fair that, that they get the credit. So thank you for watching. Um, if you want to subscribe, that's great. We're not a you know big subscriber type channel. We're just uh, simple and uh, having fun. So if you're already a subscriber, thank you so much for being here. We appreciate each and every one of you. And uh, if you're just cruising by, checking us out, thank you for that too. But I hope this is helpful and uh, hope we can see you guys down the road. Until the next one, peace out.